Esta es la versión en inglés del mismo informe que acabo de hacer en español sobre la economía de Perú. Entra Soundbite en español con Mario Vargas Llosa diciendo No me aplaudan tanto que pueda lanzar mi candidatura a la presidencia. This is Mario Vargas Llosa joking about the possibility of running for president of Peru. The writer who was presenting his book at the National Museum in Lima is not a stranger to Peruvian politics. In the 1990s, he ran for president on a liberal agenda, an agenda that has certain appeal to many while the economy is growing over 8% annually. We have another thought from Renan Quispe, jefe del INE, translated, says the most dynamic segments in December were manufacturing with a 14.66% increase, followed by the construction industry with 10.71% and imports with 11.21%. Peru's GDP grew 8.31% annually in December, showing an increasing tendency over the past 14 months. The economy is the top issue among Peruvian voters, so much so that the main presidential candidates for April 2011 elections are talking about it, such as Mercedes Arauz, presidential candidate of APRA, Spanish soundbite, translated, we are going to keep up the hard work to advance our position in the polls to prove we can keep growing the upcoming years. Former President Alejandro Toledo believes the nation's wealth should be distributed among the lower social classes. We have his soundbite here that says we must generate more income for the productive sectors. Forza 2011, presidential candidate Keiko Fujimori handed out toys in Tarapoto as part of her political campaign. Her soundbite goes, we have to improve the government officials' salaries. This kind of message may sound a bit demagogic, however, it can bring significant political gain in a country where the per capita income is $2,500 a year.